context about heart rate variability itself. That's the basis of all the measurements that we do with both with first beat sports and with first beat life. We we want to collect data that's very accurate. So that means that we are analyzing heart rate variability. And what that is, is the beat by beat changes in heart rate. How much this time between beats varies from one beat to the next. These are millisecond values that you can see here. So we are detecting the R wave and then measuring the time between heartbeats. And this, this phenomena called heart rate variability, it's mediated by the autonomic nervous system. And in a way, it allows us to get a view into the sympathetic part of the nervous system, which is the activating part that mobilizes our body's resources and gets us, re gets us ready for action, sort of the fight or flight of the nervous system. And then the parasympathetic part, which is the calming down the recovery when heart rate slows down and heart rate variability increases. And when we, when we do our analytics, we utilize heart rate variability as a window into what's happening in the body, the physiological processes that are going on to show, show what's happening actually in real life. 